is my preview for Kentucky's upcoming game against Northern Illinois. They're coming off a loss against Vandy. They was up like 28 to 14, and then it, things just started falling apart. Again, they was top to finish at the top of the MAC, them and Miami of Ohio, who we already played. And, but they lost to Vandy, I think it was by 10 or something like that. And we're coming off a win against Youngstown State. We won 31-0. to zero. Had some turnovers. Will Levis throws two picks. We fumble the ball. A bunch of plays that didn't get any yards or yards for loss. Run game still hasn't got established. A lot of things to be fixed. So, I mean, we have to take care of business if we want the at Ole Miss game to mean a lot. Like, I mean, I want... I want to really click on offense, get the run game going. I know we still don't have Rodriguez back. He will be back against Ole Miss. But I still, Cavassier, Smoke, and uh, all of our running backs, they need to get it going. I mean, they really do this week. I know it seems like it's a repeat every week that our O-line needs to play better and we need to get the run game established. But, I mean, we really do because Ole Miss is one week away after Saturday. After this upcoming Saturday, it's the next game. So, I mean, we got to get that run game established. Defense has just been phenomenal this season. It It's insane. Like, this is on the level of 2018 defense so far. I know I didn't film too much content on the Youngstown State game because it was Youngstown State. But still, I mean, they, on defense, they, I think we got a five plus, it might have even been 10 uh, plays that was negative yardage running the ball sacks, just different stuff, and that's the FCS school. So, I mean, if we don't get those little issues fixed, I mean, I don't see us running the ball on Ole Miss, Georgia, even Tennessee, who a lot of people pick to have a bad defense starting the year. So we got to get those issues fixed, and this Northern, this, uh, Northern Illinois game is the last week to do so because after that you play at Ole Miss – South Carolina, Mississippi State, Tennessee, Georgia, Missouri, and all the, the, the big part of the schedule that's uh, key to our season. But as a fan's perspective, we just need to enjoy being top 10 because it's not every season that we will be top 10. I mean, it could be. We could be for the next five. We could be top 10. Who knows? But this is our first time being top 10 since 2018, These this uh, last week and this upcoming week. And hopefully we take care of business versus Northern Illinois, stay top 10. But we'll see. I mean, should be a fun game. Hopefully we pack it out. I mean, we packed out the first week versus the Miami of Ohio. This is an ESPN2 game. I never in my life would think that we'd be playing Northern Illinois or Max School and be playing on ESPN2. That's how far our football program has come. But anyway, go Big Blue and let's just take care of business.